Okay, the first site that I want to evaluate with you is Medline Plus. Um, as we talked about in our criteria for evaluation, one of the most important things you need to know is who put the site out. Uh, this site is quite good. Already at the top of the page, we can see that this is a service of the um, National Library of Medicine and the National Institutes of Health. Uh, another good way to figure out who put a website out is to look for the About Us. Um, so here you can see that there is a About Medline Plus. A good website will um, offer this to you so you can get an idea of who they are. Also, a Contact Us is a good one. FAQs, this site has all of those things. Um, and then there's also information here. We have an actual um, address. Uh, for the National Library of Medicine. Um, so let's go ahead and look at about Medline Plus. Okay, so here on the about Medline Plus, we have a little blurb about what the goals of Medline Plus are. Again, another good thing. They're letting you know what they're, um, what they're trying to do, what the information that they want to put out is, what the goal is of the website. Um, and then here, all these are different places where they're explaining who they are and also their quality guidelines and quality control. So you can see that there's an advisory group and you can see who um, advises for putting Medline Plus together and you can see that there are a lot of people who are working um, in for different centers and institutes and um, well-known organizations. All of these people you could look up in Google and see um, find out information about them. That's a good way to also get an idea about who's putting out information on the site. Um, there's awards and press recognition. Also, I thought was great when I was looking at it, was the quality guidelines. These should look very familiar to you. As I said before in our lecture, there are different ways that you can go about evaluating a site. There are different criteria, but they all tend to be round about the same. Um, so we have quality, authority, accuracy of health content. This is how they decide whether or not to use a piece of information or to link to another website on their site. So they're letting you know that these are the standards that information has to go through before it can be published on their site. So I think that that is also very helpful. So all in all, just going off of credibility or authority, I would say that Medline Plus would be an example of a very good site. Um, you can also click on the FAQs and have a look around and see. They'll talk to you about how they select information that's obviously on the quality guidelines. Uh, general questions, what is Medline Plus? And they give you an answer. So, okay, moving on to the next site.